topic of this video is going to be calculations involving standard form, particularly around division. So for example, if you have a question that says, what's 8 times 10 to the power of 6 divided by 2 times 10 to the power of 3? Then we can do 8 divided by 2, which is 4. And then you'll remember from our work on indices that 10 to the power of 6 divided by 10 to the power of 3 means we can subtract the powers. So 6 take away 3, that's 10 to the power of 3. Next example, 1.6 times 10 to the power of 5 divided by 4 times 10 to the power of 2. First of all, we'll do 1.6 divided by 4. Well, that's 0 0.4 times 10 to the power, and then 10 to the power of 5 divided by 10 to the power of 2. We can subtract the powers, so we get 10 cubed, 10 to the power of 3. Now, you'll notice that this number is not in standard form. Well, the whole that is not in standard form at the moment because the number at the beginning here is not between 1 and 10, not including 10. So we can write that as 4 times 10 to the power minus 1 because this is equal to this. And then we just tag on the last part times 10 to the power 3 and then simplify that. So 4 times and then because we've got a multiplication here, we, do, we can add the powers. So minus 1, add 3 is 2. So a couple of questions for you to try. Firstly, um, I'd like you to do um, 9 times 10 to the power 8 divided by 3 times 10 to the power 4. And then secondly, I'd like you to try 1.5 times 10 to the power 12 divided by 5 times 10 to the power 4.